Hello there. Hello there. Hello there. It's your boy, Tasty Cake. I noticed I babbled for 48 minutes. Exactly. Like, ugh. Telling them just all these things. I, was, I can barely get people to watch a couple minutes. I, oh, crud. So basically, take care of yourself. You know, people are stupid out there. People who want to cause problems for you. But let's start off with little things. You're not going to live forever. Your body deteriorates. I got that pimple on my face here and here, right where the tumor was, on my neck and my forehead and all over the place. Eyes, I wear trifold, trifold, trifocal lenses. The hair issue, mm. the broken bones. The the guts, the, the kidneys, everything. You know, two people I know, they're on dialysis. One my one person has had health issues all of her life. And we don't do things. I mean she's you know with someone else that's that's a better positive thing there. But we don't smoke, you know. That's the one main thing. It was you putting in all those toxins. I mean, now this is linked to something on e-cigarettes too. Like, what I'm saying, you eat the various foods, deli and deli cheese. Now it's causing there's a outbreak on that too. Uh, so no matter what you eat, what you drink, what you put in your body, it's like it's killing you. People that the hepatitis is going around again. You, uh, listeria, the COVID, because someone opened his damn mouth, that's mutating because the people that don't want to take the virus don't believe in it, so they're spreading it. I know two people that died from it. One of them, I get used to him. He, was, he had an attitude, but I competed, so we, we, were, we were good with each other. It was at the beginning. He's walking around. He didn't wear a mask. He said, yeah, I got COVID. He didn't care they spread the virus to anyone. He's like, you know what? I'm dying. He he died. He's like, you know, I got COVID. So he died from it. And meatloaf, he died from it. Didn't care. Didn't care who they gave it to. Because I want everyone else to suffer as well. All these criminals out there. All these newer ones that, you know, throw f cheese on the car. Uh, stuff of paper paper towel that's soaked on the door handle, plastic gloves, you know, something, you see something like that, call the police, you know, get into a safe place, call the police and have them surround the area and take care of it. A woman, she was in Walgreens, some big giant van parked, squeezed in between two cars, had the Walgreens employee walk out with her. And as she walked out, she saw someone sitting on a passenger side, jumped into the driver's side and zoomed out. So, local crimes. Then you get the psychos that are doing the 200-man army that want to just end everything else because they don't believe in the how America is acting. Of course, the idiot in charge has cut off oil supplies in the U.S. as pissed off the Saudis. So, the oil production is cut down. Gas prices will skyrocket higher. And the dollar is weakened yet again. But it's more important to take care of the people that don't like the idea that there's a naked statue in the museum. Yeah, remember all those statues that were taken down? Like, well, we just put them on the museum. You think people are going to go to a museum? Some of them were destroyed getting in there. The Georgia Guidepost. There's nothing wrong with that. I always wanted to go to the Georgia Guidepost. I wished I could have gone to the Georgia Guidepost. Like two and a half, three hours away from me. That was destroyed because someone set off explosions and like, well, it's, that's it. It's gone forever. Because someone got offended. Wah, 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 wah. Oh, I don't like these statues. I'm offended. Wah, 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 wah. Triggered. So because you're offended and the others don't give a flying fart, you want to destroy it. That's how humanity is. Complete ignorance. 
Now we have missiles aiming at us. So in the event which we shall occur of the nuclear fallout, be in a steel building. Cover your eyes and your hands, put your thumbs in your ears and breathe through your mouth. And be there for 48 hours because if you don't, the shockwave will puncture your eardrums. All of the residuals will explode your lungs. If you're outside, <laughs> watch the clip from the day after. Terrifying, but true. I mean, here's something people don't understand. SpongeBob, right? Bikini Bottom. Character mutated sea creatures talking, walking, having jobs, wearing clothes from the 50s. In the Bikini Islands is where they test the atomic bomb. Bikini Islands. Bikini bottom. In the 50s. In the 50s. Mutation. Oh, duh. SpongeBob SquarePants. So I was watching SpongeBob SquarePants and people get offended by looking at pictures online in a museum which they'll never go to or could afford to or dare go because they're whatever want to complain of naked statues oh look at those statues there i remember those statues they didn't tear them all down don't care we want nothing you want nothing at all you want no trees no life you just be a barren thing and complain there's nothing for me to do nothing for me to see i'm a dumb ass read a book oh yeah the book remember book burning happened records were smashed because hate crimes and so forth all along ignorance of stupid people thinking they can get their ways and way 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 you didn't get your lollipop way 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 you didn't get a participation sticker duh world is going to hell in the handbasket all these stupid things are done by yourselves by others by the universe no the universe doesn't care about you you're pissing off the planet the planet's gonna it's on its way. The idea of nothing else exists outside this planet shows complete utter ignorance. And even the spiritual world, for God's sakes. My assistant manager yesterday told me she was watching things on Facebook. All these little scary ghost stories. I said, yeah. I said, At 3 o'clock in the morning, if you're, when you're, so where is it? 3 o'clock in the morning, you always have spirits watching you. But it turned up on my memories. I'm going to read it, then I'm going to do my grammar police. Do you know? It would be funnier if I said, did you know? Most of us often wake up at night between 2 a.m. to 3 a.m. without any reason. And according to the experts, comma, there is 99% chance that something is actually staring at you for a long time. Now it's scary. I would have said, now that's scary, exclamation point. She said, she read it was either 3 or 3.30 in the morning till 5 a.m. If you had to go to the bathroom, don't look in the mirror because it's not you looking back at you. I said, I can believe it. I woke up at 3.13 this morning, had to go to the bathroom. My left kidney was hurting. Thankfully, it stopped. Thankfully, I am drinking more water. Uh, you know, there goes Deuce Bigelow. Babouche. Wash my hand, avoid looking into the mirror. But if I did, I would have said, Hello there, it's your boy, Tasty Cake. And if it turns out, I go, <laughs> Now I go, Oh, shh. But I didn't. I'm, from now on, I would, I would not. Because I had the, the dreams of. I'm in my room with three particular dreams. I can't remember which order it was anymore. But it was supposed to say I woke up, the light was coming through the window, and the door opened. No one was behind her. I think I woke up before I saw who was coming through the door. Open my eyes, darkness. Another one was the same idea, but this time it was a metal right hand claw touching my leg. Woke up, nothing. 
I think that was the order. And then the third one was I felt the bed drop, like someone getting in bed with me. Hasn't happened again, but I keep, gotta keep remembering these things, so you gotta change your evil ways, baby. I repent all my sins because you know I I just don't want to fall back into a deep depression. I'm tired of people treat me the way they do, so I treat them back the same way because that's what Pisces do. Live and let die, eye for an eye. It's not the right thing, but as I get over it, they're gone soon enough. They'll be dead soon enough. COVID is a real thing. Got a clue. As it, all these viruses, you're not about to live forever. You're going to die. So let's make the right thing about it. That's why I just want to be rich. Buy things I want. One things I want tomorrow not gonna happen because I gotta do a lot of errands. I'm praying for one. Th I really want one thing. I want the heat skeleton through Mattel Creations. Um, 12 p.m. Eastern, nine nine a.m. Pacific. Specific. I just want one heat skeleton, just one, so I can take him out and use my display. I'd be happy with that. The Star Wars stuff, I really think about. Like, okay, it'd be kind of cool, but you know, knee and numb. I would like to put him in there, but I got it. I bought a vintage one, used, abused, but he's here. The figure's there. Revenge of the Jedi. Vader was had the red on him. I can go Dollar Tree, pick up the five dollar figure or big lots, or whoever has it. I know Dollar Tree does because I was there yesterday. Get some blue paint. Paint light super blue because that's in the picture. Take a washable red paint and just go lightly over it. Then I have my version of the Revenge of the... My version of Vader that's seen in the picture. And it cost me under $10. So that's always the option there. R2 would be cool, but like, okay... Uh, Go with that 3PO. That'd be awesome. But everything is expensive. And it's going to cost money. And dollars devaluating. So you got to do what you got to do. But don't waste money. Don't let... Don't... How can I say this? Government's going to screw us up one way or another. Either causing the nuclear f fallout. Raising of oil prices, which cost more of everything. Using people's tax dollars to pay for things that are not necessary. Like pay for other people's food. Which they have hundreds and hundreds of dollars in reserve. And they don't care. Because they, they got their SUVs, gold bling bling. And cell phones that are worth way too much. No. Stop that. Stop taking care of these people that don't care. And did you know all these things are in the Bible? Zombies, which we know do, do exist. Seder, wizards, witches. Mm -hmm. A cockatrice. Big giant. Big giant rooster that's green. Demons. I mean, that's... We know there's demons, for God's sakes. There's spirits and demons all over the place. Unicorns. Talking donkey. Dragons. So why do Christians get upset when we call it a fairy tale? We had a talking snake, for God's sakes. I mean, Adam and Eve. Then how is it the God created Lilith that she was banished? So Lilith created what? How was Lilith determined based on the Old Testament, New Testament? Like which one's the right ones? And you have the good book and it's like you got two different versions of the book. And they got those that don't believe in that book. And they have the other books and they have their other books. They have other books. So you're trying to tell people that their religion is wrong? You know, making everyone happy is impossible. Pissing them off is a piece of cake. I like cake. You can only do so much. You want to get so much, too. I mean, I still got a box right here. You can't see it. Well, there's a box right here. I opened it. I don't remember sitting right now. I got all these candies on below. I got papers here. I should have brought more. I should have brought at least two more down there. One for two other people. So I still wouldn't have six more, which I'm never going to use. 
But, you know, should have done the sun pass thing, which I didn't, I didn't think about. I didn't think it would work, and it does work. I should have got this freaking sun pass, everything right there, but, you know, I'll do it before I get down there. I'm going to my vacation in February instead of March because, you know, celebrating my birthday is one thing, but it's also during spring break, so it's like hell's bells. Can't do anything. To overload it, so if I go February, a little bit cooler. Plan it out right. I'm going to just jump over Epcot and go straight to Animal Kingdom this time. So I'm going to flip it. Flip it good. I do that one. I do want that one thing from Epcot, though. Talked about it before. People always provoke you until they bring out your ugly side, then play victim when you are when you go there. So. Uh, quote Genesis Phil Collins God will take good care of you just do as I say don't do as I do you gotta be a better person you cannot drop to the level of these pieces of filth even though you can be better at it and most of us are better at it they will continue on and then they'll bring other people along and it'll cause you problems when all you want to do is just be calm and peaceful play with your toys and listen to music all day you know I got Candy Crush Saga, which I let going on here, and it's telling me I should do this and that. So, okay, I'm going to follow through here. This uh, all games are hard, and this one's and every every single thing is like this one's getting my nerves because I'm not getting it down right. But I continue on. I want to do that, but that didn't happen. Got an explosion there. There's only so much we can do. There's so much time in the day. I mean, it's already 11 a.m. And I'm doing the second video because the last one was rambled on for 48 minutes. So this one's going to be under 20. Just do the best you can. Don't think you're superior than everyone else. Just live your own life. Don't live beyond your means. You know, keep yourself happy. It's not going with you. And at the end... Like I said, ninety-eight percent of people are going down. The other two percent are going up. Say, what did you do? You know, how did you? Were you kind? Twelve doctor says, be kind. I'm kind of I, I, sadly, I treat people the way they treat me because I'm tired of feeling garbage. All the little things I do, you know, I got the strap around my wrist. It hurts. You see the indentations showing off. Say, oh, look, I can do I can entertain you. And cause I'm the entertainer. Billy Joel's song. That was a good song. But when, at the end, when it comes down to pop, 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 goes my wrist again. You hurt yourself. Just take care of yourself. You know, take care of your family. Have them take care of you. Just treat them right. Treat them to do the right thing. That's all we can do. Why be so, why so angry? Don't be like these horrible people. The horrible people will get what they deserve soon enough. There's other people that do it for you. And it's all called karma. It takes time, but if a police officer, they're not crooked, they'll do the right thing and deal with them. For the most part. Again, if they're not crooked. Do what you have to do. Just be happy. Don't fall in lines of stupidity and greed. Enjoy what you can because life's ending faster than you think. So we'll leave it on that. And let's and I'm gonna come back on Tuesday. Let's see what I ordered through Hasbro Pulse, if anything. And if anyone anyone could get me He Skeletor from Mattel Creations Tuesday starting at 9 a.m. Pacific time 12 noon Eastern $18 plus tax plus shipping I got the PayPal going I'll send you the PayPal immediately and give you my address and I'll be one happy camper that's one thing I want really want the other is Star Wars stuff like well been nice to have a long time ago you know, knee and numb. I got again. I got knee and numb. 
I got a Vader I can paint. An R2 at scale and uh, Vader with a with a broken mask, you know. That'd be kinda cool, but you know, whatever. Gotta go forward. Cause it's it's not gonna end it's not gonna end pretty, Maple. Not gonna end pretty. So again, time waits and turns slowly. <laughs>